it's Jessie. Welcome to my channel. So today I created this makeup look. I'm not really sure what I'm calling it yet, but if you look at the title, I'm sure I figured something out. So if you want to see how I put together this look, just keep watching. I've already primed my face, so I'm ready for foundation. In my last video, I tried out the new Clarisonic foundation brush with the Makeup Forever stick foundation. Today, I'm gonna be trying it out again, but with the Makeup Forever Ultra HD liquid foundation. See if we get any different results. So I'm just gonna dot that on my face. Kind of like that. Oh, yeah, here we go again. So I did a pretty light application and it did blend out very nicely. I didn't put any Fix Plus on the brush like I did last time, but it still went on very evenly. It's a little thin, so I'm gonna go in with another layer. It was still a little patchy up near my eyes because I couldn't really get that close with that brush, so I'm just gonna take the leftover foundation on my brush and just pat that in. So I'm not sure I really love the brush. I feel like you still have to do a little bit of work afterwards. To set underneath my eyes, I'm gonna go in with the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Powder Foundation. For my eyes today, I think I want to do sort of a cool tone, taupey look. So I'm going into my Morphe 35T palette. I'm going to start with this shade right here. Next, I'm going to go into this shade right here. The other online order that I placed this week that I'm really excited for it to come in so I can start playing is I got a whole bunch of Wet n Wild uh, highlighters. I actually went to three different Walmarts in my area looking for Wet n Wild stuff. And I found one highlighter at one of the stores and all the other stores had like nothing. So I was just like, screw it, I'll order it online. And then I'm gonna pick up this shade right here and dab that on the outer corner. Then I'm just gonna take a clean brush and blend that out a little bit. For liner, I'm gonna take Costa Riche by MAC. Okay, I popped on some lashes. These are the Starlit Lashes by House of Lashes. For my lower lash line, I'm gonna go back into this color. For my lower waterline, I'm gonna go into the same Costa Riche pencil that I used to line my top lid. For bronzer today, I'm gonna to use the MAC Studio Care Blend Powder in the shade Dark Deep. For blush, I'm gonna go into the Morphe 9N palette and I'm gonna pick up this shade right here. And then for highlighter, I'm gonna go into Prosecco Pop in the Becca Jaclyn Hill palette. To line my lips, I'm gonna use the MAC Pencil in Soar.
And then I'm gonna go in with the Androgyny Liquid Lipstick from Jeffree Star Cosmetics. Okay, and finally, I'm gonna set my face with my MAC Fix Plus. Okay, and here's the finished look. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.